Hey Virgo, thank you for coming to my channel, Healing to Express. We're going to go ahead and see what Spirit has for you this morning for the next 24 hours, alright? What's coming towards you for the next 24 hours, how about that? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. What do Virgo need to know? Also like, subscribe, and share. Thanks to the new subscribers. Really appreciate you guys. Alright. Wow. We got the five of pentacles. Negative thoughts manifesting into real challenges. Fear surrounding money. Reach out to others for assistance. Poor timing for becoming self-employed. Okay. So maybe somebody's having a, la um, a lack mindset when it comes around finances having negative thoughts it's time to channel those thoughts to positive thoughts okay say your affirmations know that you have more than enough okay let's see what else is coming towards you guys all right spirit what else is coming towards our virgos for the next 24 hours. It's coming for Virgo. Okay. There they go, falling on the floor. Wow. That was the Ace of Cups, okay? So it's looking like you're going to have fulfillment coming towards you. A new beginning, a new lover, a new friendship here, Virgo. Okay, tell me about the Ace of Cups. Why is it here for Virgo? Wow, a King of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, or a Pisces. Someone that is in their power. They make clear decisions based on what is true. This could be a leader, okay? This is someone that is a logical thinker. This could be a father figure. Take it how it resonates, okay? And this person could be spying on you, all right? The Page of Swords. Or they're, they're trying to have confidence maybe to come towards you, okay? Maybe bring about, bring about some justice, some fairness, okay? Of some bull that they probably done done, okay? <laughs> All right, spirit, what else is going on? I'm going to put that back. What else is coming towards Virgo for the next 24? Wow, we got an emperor and we got the three of swords. So we have an Aries, okay, here that could be broken hearted. Take it how it resonates. We got the three of swords. We also have the lovers in reverse at the bottom of the deck. Star in reverse. Knight of swords in reverse. Nine of cups. In, okay, wow. Yeah, so this Aries, if you was dealing with an Aries, they're broken hearted. All right. Maybe, I don't know. Let's just see, guys. What's going on? So maybe somebody has two kings in their energy. They have a king of cups and they have an emperor. Okay. So let's see what's going on. I don't want my cards to be in reverse. All right. Tell me about the ace of cups. Why is it here for Virgo? Wow. Okay. So this is the truth that you got a new beginning coming in, Virgo. Okay. New opportunities making sound decisions you got clarity maybe on the situation here tell me about the ace of swords why is it here for virgo yeah that somebody definitely wants to come rushing in we got the knight of cups okay somebody wants to be maybe passionate okay romantic and then we got the queen of cups okay they see you as loving the queen of cups is also someone that's intuitive okay the queen of cups is very loving very kind very sensitive very warm you know could be a caregiver as well all right so we got the queen of cups and the king of cups already on the table okay so let's see and we got the chariot yeah somebody's definitely coming in tell me about this king of cups why is the king of cups here Okay, they go that lovers in reverse. Unrequited love, okay? One sided relationship. Needing to practice self love, okay? Wow, tell me about the lovers. Why is it here? 
Yeah, somebody's in mental prison, okay? Page of Wands, okay? They could be immature as well. Maybe you do have some good news coming in, okay? Take it how it resonates. But somebody's stuck in their head, okay? Maybe they want to go on a, a new passionate adventure here. Tell me about the Page of Wands for Virgo Spirit. Yeah, the Seven of Pentacles, okay? So maybe they're putting a lot of work into a situation. Or maybe they have put a lot of work into a love relationship that they're stuck in their head about. It could resolve children as well. Maybe this is why negative thoughts magnify into real challenges because this person is dealing with maybe finance finances okay wow so we have the emperor here okay the emperor is someone that's in authority and in leadership could be a father figure here okay tell me about the emperor wow we got the queen of pentacles hmm. and then we got the page of cups Hmm. We got the Seven of Swords. So what I'm getting from this Emperor, maybe they have a Queen of Pentacles here. Okay, someone that's very stable or grounded. Okay, and um, the page once again is a messenger. Maybe, maybe this Queen of Pentacles tried to send this Emperor a message and they didn't respond. Take it how it resonate. Okay. Because this person is a liar. They're a liar. They're a cheater. Okay. They're a deceiver. Somebody feels left out in the cold. And the world is closing out. This cycle is over with this emperor. Okay. Yeah. But now they're broken hearted. But they probably left you out in the cold. Let's see. Tell me about the three of swords. Yeah. Wow. We got the empress coming out. Hmm. Huh. So maybe, because the four swords can talk about anxiety, okay, needing to rest. It can talk about chaos. So maybe it's a lot of chaos going on with this empress here, okay? Somebody that's in their power. Why is the empress here, spirit? So we got the emperor and the empress here. Maybe this empress is in hermit mode, okay? But this I don't know. Somebody has a deep connection. We got the two of cups here. So maybe somebody has a deep connect connection with this empress, but they're not healing whoever this person is. This person is not healing. They want to communicate. They want to come rushing in, but they're taking a slow time, resting and rejuvenating. And this cycle look like it's closing out, Virgo. Wow. Yeah. It look like you got a lot coming towards you <laughs> for the next 24 hours. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Fair. What's the most like outcome for this spread we just did? Uh, Virgos. What's the most like outcome? Wow. Tower. Okay. Um, listening to your intuition. The high priestess. Okay, we got the Three of Cups, and we have the Six of Pentacles, and we got the Queen of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. So it's looking like either somebody had a tower moment, going to have a tower moment, okay? You definitely need to listen to your intuition, all right? Maybe someone had secrets, and they're going to be coming out here, that somebody had a third party, and that they was given to more than one person here. So you just take it how it resonates, guys. This is what I have for you for the next 24 hours. Like and subscribe.